shaping humanity boils down to one simple molecule, H2O, the molecule that made us. Continues tomorrow at nine on BBC Four and iPlayer. Welcome to Newsday, reporting live from Singapore. I'm Karishma Viswani. The headlines, more than 40 people are dead after record rainfall causes flash flooding across the northeast of America. A British-born member of the Islamic State group pleads guilty to charges of his conspiring to murder American hostages in Syria. In Afghanistan, a new normal with the Taliban setting up a government as those who still want to get out await their future. So many Afghans wondering, worrying, what kind of new government will emerge with all of its rules and regulations? Many others still asking ever so anxiously, how can they escape? Japan is the first nation to host the Paralympic Games twice. But what's it like to be a disabled person living there? It's ABBA's first album of new material for 40 years, backed up by a series of virtual concerts. Live from our studio in Singapore, this is BBC News. It's Newsday. It's eight in the morning in Singapore and eight in the evening in New York, where the tail end of Hurricane Ida caused major flooding in the northeast of the U.S. on Wednesday night. More than 40 people were killed in the flash floods. The governors of New York and New Jersey have declared states of emergency, and President Biden has promised federal aid. Our correspondent, Nala Tafik, 